Bitch, we working through the late night, late night. We grind hard, trying to take flight, take and fly. I need a bitch. My name is JJ. I go by Valley Boy Chose. Call me Galaxy. Right at the Valley, though. What's the line between brother and co-worker when you two are working together? For me, honestly, like, there really isn't a line. I always know he's got my, you know, my best interests at heart, so I'm never worried about anything like that. Exactly, and I, I don't even feel like there is a, a necessarily needs to be a, a line drawn. Because you know? it's more like a team, honestly, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? It's, it's a team thing, so like yeah, I said, yeah. if you got an input, I'm going to listen to it. If I don't like it, I ain't going to do it, but I'm always listening to it. <laughs> What's the process for you guys, you know, from start to finish of a song? Uh, with that, I mean, it, usually it's just either sitting in the in the studio, listening to a beat, just kind of getting ideas together, throwing ideas back and forth. Uh, sometimes we might even be separate. We might just be throwing ideas through text or, or whatever the case yeah. may be. Yeah, a lot of times for me, you know, I'll pick out my beats first. Like, I'll probably, there'll be times I'll pick out 10 beats at a time, go through all of them. I kind of get the idea in my head. I'm starting to get the concept down, the melodies. I want to use some big on melodies. That's how I'll do it. As I'll get the melodies kind of figured out, and then the wordplay kind of comes after I start filling it in. But me, I'm more, I'm big on the beats. Like the beat, I gotta feel that thing, and then I'm gonna get into it after I start going to work on it. So you guys have uh, put out a couple of videos. What was that experience like? And was the end result what you guys expected, or was yeah. it different? That was that was dope. And I gotta say, first thing, big shout out to Krimsky for doing that because he was the one that was professional about it. I mean, he's the one you gotta go to if you want a video. Go to him or New, my guys out there. But the process was super dope because that was something we've been trying to do for a while. It's just we knew we got songs out, but we need a visual. We need people to be able to see who we are, who's making this music. And for him to put it together, how he did the first one we did, crazy, just hey. clean, man. I can't complain. What What would be a success at the end of your careers for you guys? Success, honestly, my biggest thing, what I want to do is, like I said, I see it how Mario Chalmers did it with basketball for Alaska. I want people to realize we got talent up here for Alaska music. I want people to see, hey, Alaska, you know, they doing something. They got skill. They have talent up there. And my end run is just to be able to, like, I, I love making music. I'll make it regardless if I get paid or not. Like, I'm in it to make music. I love making music because it's what I like to hear. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I mean, I'd say in the in the beginning, it was, oh, yeah, I just want to be rich and famous off the music or, or something like that. But man, now it's really to put Alaska, um, let alone the valley, on the map and really mm -hmm. just break down that stigma, you know, brick by brick. Yeah. What can people expect from 574 in the near future? Next thing we're doing, and we're actually trying to do a group project, actually. So it's 574 and uh, Barely Blunt Collective, actually. Chris Ray, my guy who runs uh, Barely Blunt, and also Lee Jones, he's working with us. We're trying to do a collaborative mixtape. Um, so it's going to be all three of us, and actually Chris Capper will be featured on it. Um, so we'll have that group mixtape, and I'm also working on a solo mixtape my, uh, myself. I don't know if it's going to be takeoff season two, but I'm working towards something like that. And then I know he's also got some stuff coming out. Yes, sir. Got that Who I Really Am Part 2. It's going to be an album of, rather than a mixtape. Yeah, um, yeah. So something that we, that we put up on iTunes and, and <laughs> really push hard on that one. Hey. Rick and Daddy's on the beat. Bitch, we working through the 